Hello, in this problem we're going to verify that these two functions are inverses. So verify that f and g are inverse functions, so they are inverses. So to do this, uh, we just have to check two things. We have to check that f o g of x that needs to be equal to x. And we also have to check that g o f of x is also equal to x. So by verifying these two things, we'll show that these functions are actually inverses. Okay, let's go ahead and do it. Let's start with this one here. So f o g of x. So this is basically the same thing as f of g of x. And what this says is you just replace the g with what it is. So this is equal to f of 5 fourths x minus 15 over 2. All right, and then all you do is plug this into f. So this whole thing here is your x, so this is equal to, so replacing x with all of this, right, all of this is your x, so 4 fifths, and then we have 5 fourths x minus 15 halves, right, so it's 4 fifths times x, right, that's your x, plus the 6 on the outside, so be really, really careful here. Okay, so now we're going to go ahead and distribute. So let's see, uh, 4 fifths times this, I'll go ahead and write it, 4 fifths times 5 fourths x, and then same thing here, 4 fifths times this, so minus 4 fifths times 15 over 2. And then we still have the plus and the 6. So it looks like these go away, which is really good. So we get x, and let's see, 5 goes into 15 three times, and then 2 goes into 4 twice. 2 times 3 is 6, so minus 6 plus 6, boom, so we get x. So we've checked the first one, the first one is good. Let's go ahead and check the second one. I'm going to go ahead and write down um, the functions again so we have them here on the screen. So we had f of x, and that was equal to 4 fifths x plus 6. And g of x is equal to 5 fourths x minus 15 halves. All right, so now we're going to check g of f of x. Let's go ahead and do that. So g o f of x. So this means g of f of x. And so we replace the inside piece. So this is g of, I just replace f of x with what it is. So this is 4 fifths x plus 6. This is equal to, so this is your x, this whole thing here. So now you look at g and just replace x with all of this. So this is 5 over 4, and then your x is 4 fifths x plus 6. Then you have minus 15 halves. All right, let's go ahead and distribute. So 5 fourths times 4 fifths, 5 fourths times 4 fifths x, and then 5 fourths times 6, so plus 5 fourths times 6. And that's minus 15 halves. All right, so these cancel. So we have x. Let's see here, uh, 4 goes into 6. Well, no, it doesn't go into 6. 2 goes into 4 twice and it goes into six three times. So this is plus five times three is 15. 
We have a two on the bottom and then minus 15 halves. Boom, so we get x. So we've checked that both work, right? We computed both, both things that we needed to show, right? We needed to show that, go back up here and I'll show you, f o g of x is equal to x and g o f of x is equal to x. So therefore we have verified that these functions are inverses. Not really a hard problem, just takes a little bit of time to do. I hope this video has been helpful. Good luck.